Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. This is my first official video of many more, I hope. Today I have about 10 CDs that I'm going to go through. Uh, before we dive into that though, uh, hit like or subscribe, I would really appreciate it. Uh, the first CD I'm going to show is one I purchased off eBay. It's Genesis, live in Europe. It's a two CD set. And it's recorded from all different cities in uh, in Europe. It's uh, their sixth live album. It's not their best, but it's it's a good listen. The uh, next one is Neil Young, Chrome Dreams 2. It's one of his heavier albums, not as melodic or a country type as other ones. But a really good addition to my Neil Young collection, which has been growing of late. The next CD that I have is Eloy, which is a band from Germany. They're a progressive rock band. They've been around since the early 70s. This is definitely the most popular album. It's like their sixth studio album, I think, but it's definitely the most popular album. Next, we'll go to the ones I picked up from my local thrift store here. An artist I've just discovered lately is Steve Hill. He's a Canadian blues player. He's actually from Three Rivers, Quebec. This one here has a lot of more modern type blues music. I actually listened to this one last night and it's actually a really good CD. And I also picked up another one from him, which is a later one, which is a older type blues music on this one. And also, it's, it's also a good CD, too. I listened to this one, too, last night. I'm going to try and see if I can find other CDs from this artist. I really enjoyed them. Next is Paula Cole. If you like folk rock type music, she actually started by playing with Peter Gabriel in 93, I think it was, in the Secret World Tour. Uh, when actually, Peter Gabriel's on this. CD does a song with her, but uh, it's, it's a really good listen. Next, I have some gospel music, Chris Tomlin, more of a pop rock type listen. Uh, it's not very heavy, it's, it's fairly mellow, but if you like gospel music, he, he's a good artist to have in your collection. Not too familiar with him, I just discovered him last week. So, Next is Brian Setzer, you could never go wrong with this artist. This CD here is uh, more of his previous band, The Stray Cats. It's more of that type of music. It's not as big band sound as his usual CDs, but uh, another one I really enjoyed. Next, we have Glenn Miller. This is actually a three CD set. Music taken from most of his career through the 30s and 40s. If you, if you like the big band swing music, it's something to, to check out. I like to listen to this every once in a while. It's very relaxing music. Um, yeah, this is really a good addition. And my last one that I have is Jackson Brown, which is actually in a digipack. I really dislike digipacks. But anyways... Um, this is his first album in six years of new material. It's uh, typical Jackson Brown music, country rock type stuff. Uh, this too is a good listen. I listened to this one a couple days ago, which is really good. So that's it for this video. I should have another video coming up soon. And uh, hope you enjoyed it. And until next time, take care of yourselves and we'll see you later.